All right, welcome to Clan Generator. I'm going into this completely blind because I haven't seen any videos on it and I wanted to do it blindly just for the heck of it. So if I struggle with this, we're gonna struggle together. All right, we have the options of continue, switch clan, new clan, and settings. Let's go to the settings. Dark mode. <gasps> I'm, gonna I'm gonna save it on dark mode because if anybody likes their stuff in light mode, uh, they qualify for senior discount. Allow couples to have kittens despite same sex status. I'm gonna say no just for the drama sake. All right, new clan. Name your clan. What should we name the clan? Name it something earthy. Don't include clan in it. I'm so glad that they put that there because my dumb self would have absolutely put clan behind it. <laughs> it's like moon moon, but you got clan clan. <laughs> it's clan clan that's filled with a bunch of moon moons. Star stars. <laughs> it's reminding me of Target's prophecy. Um, Let's see, what should we name this clan? Uh, let's do a random, random clan name. Clan names, yay, cool. Um, I have a farm clan. They're not a real clan, but I have a bunch of cats that live on a farm and they get kind of jealous that the cats in the clans have clan names. So they're like, we can join your clans. Let's call ourselves farm clan. <laughs> And one of um, one of Fog Clan's members insults them directly to their face, and they're like, "You couldn't even have come up with a cool name like Prairie Clan or Grass Clan, Apple Clan, because you got a bunch of apple trees." No, and just they were like, "We'll be called Farm Clan." Um, okay, that that's kind of Mountain Clan, Thicket Clan, Moor Clan, Swamp Clan. Spring clan. Uh, let's go with cavern clan. Uh, we're gonna say that they live on the side of rocks or something. It's really easy to stick cats in caves. All right, it's set in stone. We have cavern clan. Let's go. Cavern clan. These 12 cats are your potential clan members. Some of them will be left behind. First, pick a leader to lead cavern clan through any difficulties. Oh, oh, we have a blue star off the bat. They're female, young adult, altruistic. Oh, we have the power to grant this cat their nine lives. Quiet heart going to quiet star. Male, young adult, strict. Sandlark. Sky star. Oh, sky star so pretty. Female, adult, wise. I feel like she would be really good as a deputy. I really hope I'm able to pick her for deputy. Russet dusk uh, going into russet star. He's a male, elder. Oh, you're an elder and you're bloodthirsty. Oh, that's scary. That's kind of scary. No, you're not going to be leader. Thanks. Oh, you're too young to- Okay, River Kid is too young to become a leader. River Kid's not. Webstar. Male, adult, confident. He looks kind He's throwing his head back. He looks kind of cocky though, so... Lizard Pounce. Lizard Star. Oh, you're a senior adult. I think you're a little bit too old. I, I don't- I don't want to appoint a leader and then have them die immediately. Blue Runner. Oh, that's, that's the second Blue Star. The first one would also be named Blue Star. We have Blue Song and Blue Runner. And I believe she has blue eyes. Adult, female, lonesome. Oh, sweet girl. She's so pretty, though. Stork Star. Adult, male, male, and daring. Oh, you're too young. And... Oh, Chive Star! Female, adolescent, and altruistic. Um, I don't know. I don't like the fact that you're bloodthirsty. I think I'm gonna go with Quiet Heart, who will become Quiet Star. He's a male, a young adult, and Strict. I feel like Strict would be able to keep the clan in line. Alright, I'm going to grant this cat their nine lives. <gasps> Yay, cool! Second choose your deputy. This cat will support their leader and take over if anything goes awry. I already wanted Sky Seed to be the deputy the moment I saw her, so... She's a female, adult, and wise. I really hope I get to choose a couple warriors. Um, because I like the orange Siamese on this one. Uh, this cat will support the leader. Third, pick your medicine cat. They will aid the sick and wounded and communicate with Star Clan. Oh, I can't do much with the kits and I feel bad. I'm not... I don't know, it'd be really interesting to have a bloodthirsty medicine cat. But I kind of... The first playthrough, I don't want anything to go super bad. Uh, let's have web pelt. Finally, recruit four to seven more members to your clan. Choose wisely. Definitely would like you. I feel like Russet Dusk would 
be an interesting plot point. I just didn't want him in the leader or the deputy or the medicine cat position because that's kind of scary. Of course, I have to have the kits. I cannot leave the kits behind. River kit and clover kit, you're coming in. I can't leave an apprentice either, so chive paw, you're in. Oh, how do I choose? There's so many, how do I choose? Not me forming an emotional attachment to these cats I've never met before, and then if I leave them behind, I'm gonna be so sad. Why are you... This He's basically a murder-hungry grandpa. You know, if he's if he's murder hungry and a grandpa, I think he can survive out on his own. Shameless. Sandlark, I feel like Sandlark will have some pretty spicy interactions with other characters. Your clan has been created and saved. Okay, so this is our allegiances so far. We have Quiet Star, a golden and white short furred Tom. Skyseed is a torty and white short furred she cat. Uh Webholt is a pale grey tabby medium furred Tom. Blue Runner is a ginger point long furred she cat. Chive Paw is a white and dark ginger long furred she cat. River Kit is a light brown and white medium furred tom. And Clover Kit is a golden and white medium furred she cat. I have the option to kill the cat. All right. All right. So we have events. Check the space to see which events are currently happening. Current season is New Leaf. Uh, nothing significant happened this moon. This is the Star Clan. Who are you? Hello, I'm here to guide the dead cats of Cavern Clan into Star Clan and patrol. These cats are currently in the camp ready for patrol. Choose up to six to take on patrol. Smaller patrols help cats gain more experience, but larger patrols are safer. Okay, let's check out what everybody's doing. Quiet Star thinks about who should mentor new apprentices. Oh, you can pick their mates too. Okay. See family, this cat, uh, okay. So they just, they're all just a bunch of cats who have no previous relations to each other, got it. Oh, what are you doing in the leader's den? Blue Runner is looking around camp. Deputy. Sky Seed is spending some time alone. So every time I click on this, it, it changes, okay. Blue Runner is looking around camp. Chive Paw's feeling happy. I'm so glad for Chive Paw. What are you doing in the elder's den? River Kit is feeling confident. All right, let's send some cats out on patrol. Actually, let me see who's, who's Chai Paw's mentor gonna be. Let's have the deputy. Oh. Oh, mentor is Sky Seed. Okay, cool, cool. I was gonna pick that one anyway. Cool. Let's send out Sky Seed and her apprentice. And I guess Blue Runner. Let's send these three out on a patrol. Oh, the, your patrol catches the scent of a fox. Our patrol leader is Blue Runner. And the skills are smart, strong connection to Starkland, very smart. Um, I kind of don't want anybody to die to a fox, so let's not proceed. Return to the clan. Where did everybody go? He's heading to the dirt place. Thanks, Webpelt. Thanks for sharing that information. He's an excellent fighter. Why? Oh. I should have chose a couple more cats. I'm gonna pick... I need to make somebody mates. So, Quiet Star, you have a choice of Sky Seed and Blue Runner. Definitely not Chive Box, that's weird. Alright, I'm gonna pair up Quiet Star and Sky Seed. I feel like they would make really cute kittens. Alright, let's time skip. <gasps> River Kit died in an accident at one moon's old. Why did River Kit die? Okay, Chive Spring, Chive Paw has become Chive Spring, and they've earned their warrior name. Cool. Oh boy. I feel like this clan's getting really small. Oh. <gasps> Clover Kit's rethinking their life choices. I think Clover Kit's really sad because the other kit died. Oh no. <laughs> Clover Kit. Quiet Star is counting how many lives they have left. They should have nine because nothing's happened to Clover. Or, nothing's happened to Quiet Star. Sky Seed is feeling quite lazy. Me too, Sky Seed. Blue Runner is gossiping. Chive Spring is rethinking their life choices. Oh, oh no. Strong connection to Star Clan. All right, let's send out another patrol because we tried to, and then there was foxes. Let's send out Sky Seed, her former apprentice, because I think that would be pretty fun. And Blue Runner. It was a fun outing and you learned a lot. Cool. Webpelt thinks they're going crazy. That's not good if you're a medicine cat. Oh. oh. Alright. 
Everything seems to be going fine. I can only patrol... I can only send one more out on patrol. I need more cats in the clan, so I'm hoping the two lovebirds create babies. Right, let's time skip again. Nothing significant happened this moon. Let's see, Quiet Star is counting how many lives they've left. You've been doing this for an entire moon, are you okay, Quiet Star? Web Pelt is relaxing in camp. Tire Spring is feeling down, Oh, She needs a friend, she's the only young warrior. Blue Runner is sharing prey with Sky Seed. How sweet. Your patrol has a disagreement. They look to Br Blue Runner to settle the dispute. Blue Runner stutters. They don't think they are fit to lead a patrol. Okay, Clover Kit's about to be apprenticed here soon. Let's skip ahead another moon. Ooh, what are y'all two doing? Blue Runner's feeling down. Oh, I feel like Blue Runner's feeling down because she's not good at leading patrols. Clover Kit is hiding from the other cats. Chive Spring is relaxing and can't. Web Pelt is visited by River Kit. Oh. <gasps> oh, I'm gonna cry. The kid visited the medicine cat. Is learning more about River Kit. Thinks about who should mentor new apprentices. All right, all I think I can do right now because there's not enough cats is just continuously send out patrols. Okay, let's have Quiet Star be the head of this patrol. Nothing can go wrong if it's the leader and the deputy, right? Let's send out the leader and the deputy. Patrol catches the son of a fox. Okay, we dodged the fox last time. The mother fox fights to defend her cubs. Quiet Star is left with a scar. I probably shouldn't have went to go investigate the fox. Quiet Star should be in the medicine den. I'm not really sure what Quiet Star is doing in the clearing. Oh, Quiet Star now has a nick in the ear. Let's send out a patrol of the remaining two and see what goes on. Um... Let's make Chive Spring lead and Blue Runner. Your patrol comes upon the son of a mouse. Proceed. Your patrol catches the mouse. Cool. Okay. River Kid is feeling sassy today. I for oh, I've been forgetting to check up on. Oh, he's feeling sassy. Oh, poor River Kid. Clover Paws started their apprenticeship. All right, let's go see who Clover Paws' mentor is. Ooh, Clover Paws pretty. Pretends to fight an enemy warrior. Oh, <laughs> is eating some fresh kill. I bet it's that mouse. Why, Quiet Star, why do you think you're going crazy? Sky Seed is rethinking their life choices. Web Pelt is proud of their ability to care for their clan mates. I'm so glad Web Pelt's getting over River Kit's death. Cause that hurt me a little bit too. Let's see what's going on in Star Clan. River Kit, what are you doing today? River Kit is spending a considerable amount of time grooming. Oh, oh, sweet baby. All right, Quiet Star. Oh, Blue Runner's decorating their nest. Sky Seed's getting kind of old. I'm kind of worried. All right, let's send out a patrol. Oh wait, no, no, wait. Let's see who's, who's your, who's your mentor? Chive Spring. Oh, <laughs> okay. Um, let's send out a patrol. Um, let's give a cat with some decent experience. None of them have decent experience. Got it. Um, let's send out, let's send out Sky Seed, um, Chive Spring, and Cloverpaw. That way there's at least an experienced warrior, uh, the newest warrior, and her apprentice. Your patrol comes upon the son of a mouse. Let's catch that mouse. Your patrol narrowly misses catching the mouse. And let's send out Quiet Star and Blue Runner. A Ripple Clan ca <gasps> That works so well because I have a Ripple Clan. Cavern Clan meets a Ripple Clan patrol at the border. Nobody is hostile. Despite the lack of outright hostilities, the situation turns awkward fast. <laughs> They said, uh, what are we gonna do? Well, I guess we'll just turn around and go home. Yeah, have a good day, Ripple Clan. Ripple Clan's like, all right, Cavern Clan, have a good day. All right, since everybody's gone, let's go ahead and skip. <gasps> Sky Seed had a litter of four kits. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for the babies. <laughs> let's see what River Kit's doing first. It's curious about the other clans. Oh my goodness, golly. Goodness, they're so cute. Okay, Quiet Star is relaxing. Sky Seed wants to spend time alone today. Ah, uh, mm, I mean, she did just have kids. I feel like her and Quiet Star got into a little spat or something. Or everybody's fawning over her new kittens and she's just like, she's a little bit over it. She's a little bit over it. What pill is gathering cobwebs? Good, you gather those supplies. Blue Runner is spending a considerable amount of time grooming. I don't blame you because you're a long haired cat in the forest. Cloverpaw is rethinking their life choices. What's so bad about clan life, Cloverpaw? I think Cloverpaw's going through, uh, Cloverpaw's probably going through her edgy teenage years. Yeah, she's seven moons. That's like the human equivalent to like 11 or 12, I think. And she's like, mom. It's not a phase, mom. All right. And then Chive Spring. The first kit is called Blue Kit. 
wants to spend time alone. Uh, Blue Kit's a young male with blue eyes. And it's a little tuxedo baby. Sky Seed and Quiet Star. The next kit is Wild Kit. It's a young female with amber eyes and medium fur. You're a daydreamer. And you're noisy. Blue Kit's really noisy. Wishes other cats would stop babying them. I feel like... Okay, Gold Kit is a young male. The tabby pelt. And wishes other cats would stop babying them. I feel like Gold Kit's gonna be the be, gonna be the first one to be like, I want to be an apprentice already. I'm too old to do apprentice duties and then try to act way more mature than all the other cats, and it ends up coming back and biting them because then later in life they wish that they were just a kitten when they were a kitten. Sorry, Gold Kit. I'm sorry, Gold Kit. <laughs> and then the last one is Nectar Kit. <gasps> Look at those little eyes. It's feeling quite lazy. Like uh, Nectar Kit is an attention seeker. Those are all the new babies. I have one other male in the clan and this, the other male in the clan is the medicine cat. So I can't exactly do much with him. Oh, <laughs> Nectar Kit's in the leader's den with his mother. Oh, sweet. I'm just hanging out. All right, let's send out a patrol. Let's get Sky Seed out of the clan for a little bit away from her kits give her a little mental break let's add her let's add chive spring and her apprentice patrol comes across a rogue the rogue finally leaves but not before giving clover paw a scar i'm sorry clover paw i thought the rogue would just run away if the rogue saw three cats coming at them oh clover oh clover clover paw also has a nicked ear now sorry clover paw let's send out these two <sighs> quiet star now has two scars Quiet Star regrets not eating the bird on the fresh kill pile earlier. Oh, to be a cat just worrying about their next meal. That sounds awful. I'm going to take that back. Oh, to be a cat wondering what food they're going to be able to eat next and enjoy. Lounging around thinking about food. Sky Seed is talking to themselves. Not their kids, but themselves. While Paul is looking forward to the half moon meeting. Oh, that's right. There's going to be half. Okay. Yeah. I forgot about gatherings. <laughs> Blue Runner is visiting the medicine den. What for? I wish I could get more information from that. Cloverpaw is now eight moons and Cloverpaw is feeling gloomy. Chive Spring is grooming a lot. <gasps> Blue Kit comes up with a plan to sneak out of camp with Nectar Kit. Wild Kit's looking forward to today. Gold Kit is annoying older cats. I knew Gold Kit would be a shithead. First, he didn't want to be babied. Now he's being annoying to the older cats. Ooh, he's going to be a fun apprentice. He's, yeah, I mean, he's noisy, so. And Nectar Kid's heading to the dirt place. You guys gonna sneak out later? I see how it is. Wild Kid is spending a little bit of time in the medicine den. I feel like Wild Kid might become the medicine cat apprentice. Let's see what River Kit's doing. I was hoping they'll, they'll, they'll be, <gasps> I was hoping they'll be remembered. River Kit, I remember you. I will not forget about you. We love you, River Kit. All right, let's end out a patrol. Of course, I have to send out Chive Spring and her apprentice. Let's see, none of the experienced cats uh, I'm not gonna send out either the leader or the deputy this time and see what happens. The patrol finds a kitty pet who is interested in clan cats. The description of the clan cats frighten the kitty pet. <gasps> you know, understandable. Imagine living in a house your entire life, being fed all these uh, wonderful things and given all this water and all this soft stuff to lay on. And these cats are like, oh yeah, we fight each other. <laughs> we beat each other up for land. We have to like be on the brink of death every winter. But yeah, clan life's pretty cool. The kitty pet's just not having it and turns around and be like, sorry, never mind. I didn't I didn't want to ask in the first place. I shouldn't have asked. <laughs> Understandable. Um, let's send the two lovers out on a patrol. I'm not gonna proceed. I don't want what I don't want Quiet Star getting any more <laughs> honestly. Quiet Star got beat up pretty pretty bad. I don't know if the apprentices ever sneak out, because Blue Kit's trying to sneak out with Nectar Kit. Let's go ahead and Nothing significant happened this moon. Quiet Star is feeling happy. Sky Seed's heading to the dirt place. Web Pelt regrets not eating the bird. Blue Runner is feeling down. Oh, Blue Runner needs friends. There's nobody else her age. Cloverpaw cannot wait to be a warrior. I don't blame you, Cloverpaw. Chive Spring is giving her apprentice a task. Blue Kit is feeling gloomy. Wild Kit is rethinking their life choices. Gold Kit wishes the other cats would stop babying them. When are you gonna admit that you are the baby? Gold Kit's the baby. The absolute babyest of the babies. And Nectar Kit plays moss ball with Blue Kit. River Kit's watching over the clan. Does, does, does the, I really hope kits don't stay kits. All right, let's go ahead and patrol. Let's send out Quiet Star Blue Run. Your patrol comes upon the scent of a large rat. Patrol's confidence is sh shaken by missing the rat. Clover Clan meets a Flint Clan patrol at the border. 
but nobody is hostile. Situation turns awkward. Oh, <laughs> Nectar Kit and Gold Kit are playing in the nursery. See, Gold Kit, I told you you were a baby. I told you you were baby. Even if you don't want to be baby, you're baby. I feel like Gold Kit just got hurt and was like, stop. <laughs> and then Nectar Kit ran over to Blue Kit in the Elder's Den and was like, he's being mean. He won't play with me. <laughs> oh, River Kit's just relaxing. Quiet Star's daydreaming. Sky Seed is feeling quite lazy. Holt heard a rumor about Sky Seed. Heard a rumor about Sky Seed. Blue Runner is feeling excited. Blue Runner, you were in the medicine den. Blue Runner, Blue Runner, you were in the medicine den with Sky Seed. Or not the medicine den. Yeah, you were in one of the dens with Sky Seed. And you're feeling excited. And Web Pelt heard a rumor about Sky Seed. What is Sky Seed doing? Sky Seed is feeling quite lazy. Clover Paw is feeling sassy. Chive Spring's thinking about kits. Um, Blue Blue Kit, that's that's your brother. Blue Kit, that's your brother. <laughs> Blue Kit, you can't. Blue Kit, you can't do that. <laughs> I don't know how to break it to you, but you can't. You can't crush in your brother. That's weird. Uh, Wild Kit whines to Quiet Star. Oh, Quiet Star just want. <sighs> Quiet Star just wants to be left alone, and Wild Kit probably wants to bother him about being an apprentice already. Well, you're three moons. You're halfway there. You're close enough. Gold Kit is feeling nervous. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame Col Gold Kit for feeling nervous when Blue Kit has a crush on uh, Gold Kit. We're just going to ignore that. Wishes other cats would stop babying them. Oh, Nectar Kit's now getting picked on because Nectar Kit's the tiniest one out of all of them. Let's randomize a patrol. We're going to add Sky Seed. Okay, the leader, the deputy, and a random warrior. Let's start a patrol. The patrol tries to get their leader to tell stories about their warrior days. Quiet Star story engages the patrol. All have a good time. That was really peaceful. All right, let's send out Chive Spring and her apprentice. Patrol doesn't find anything useful. It was still a fun outing and you learned a lot. I need to know what this rumor about Sky Seed is. Nectar Kit talks with Chive Spring about love. Chive Spring really wants to love because Chive Spring was just thinking about kits. I'm sorry, Chive Spring. I don't have anybody to pair you with. Star is assessing some apprentices. Sky Seed's daydreaming. Things are going crazy. Yeah, acting suspicious. Blue Runner, why are you acting suspicious? Clover Paw is thinking about this time that they caught a huge rabbit. Chive Spring is scolding Clover Paw. Blue Kit's having a hard day. Wild Kit is feeling nervous. Gold Kit is curious about the other clans. Gotta keep an eye on him. Nectar Kit thinks that they're going crazy. I hope Blue Kit got over his crush on his brother because that was that was pretty wild there we go his mother's having a conversation with him about it <laughs> i feel like blue runner and sky seed have some weird shit going on yeah see they're okay they were in the warrior's den previously and now they're in the warrior's den together and a chive paw just happens to stumble across them let's say quiet star chive spring patrol finds a loner who is interested in joining the clan the patrol convinces the loner to join cool we have a new oh we have a new cat we have a new cat yes who are you? Horsepaw. This is the loner. Mentor is Blue Runner. Female adolescent. They're still in the warrior's den together. All right, let's send out the two potential lovers and their new kit. Your patrol has a disagreement. They look to Skyseed to settle the dispute. Skyseed manages to successfully move over any disagreement. I feel like Horsepaw joined and then is currently bitching about the way clans do their daily lives. So that might have been what the argument was over. And then Skyseed was like, guys, guys. I bet Skyseed had to remind Blue Runner that Horsepaw is new to the clan and that Horsepaw isn't going to understand everything immediately. At least time skip. Clover Moth has earned their warrior name. <gasps> I love Clover Moth as a name. Let's see what she looks like. Let's go through everyone. Quiet Star's having a hard day. <gasps> I knew it. I knew Skyseed and Blue Runner were having something going on. This, this, that's it. That's that's all. Quiet Star is starting to suspect things, and Quiet Star is absolutely not having a good day after learning this information. I'm sorry, Quiet Star. Skyseed is fighting with Horsepaw. Why are you fighting with Horsepaw? Pelt is counting the poppy seeds. Blue Runner is talking with Clover Moth. Clover Moth is acting suspicious. Why are you acting suspicious, Clover Moth? Chaya Spring is feeling sassy. Kit's having a hard day. Gold Kit is feeling excited. Yeah, Gold Kit should feel excited because they're close to getting apprenticed. And Horsepaw is eating some fresh kill. Let's send out Blue Runner and her apprentice in Skyseed. Because I, I feel like I'm going to I'm gonna pair these two. Patrol uh, finds a scent of a hair. Unfortunately, your patrol misses the hair. Quiet Star, Chive Spring, and Clover Moth. Patrol finds a loner who is interested in joining the clan. The loner thinks for a while and decides against joining. The kids are going to become apprentices next time skip. So Blue Paw, all of them have started their apprenticeship. 
<laughs> I'm so excited. Quiet Star is feeling confident. Sky Seed wants to spend time alone today. Web Pelt is wrapping a wound with cobwebs. Blue Runner caught the scent of a fox. Oh, Clover Moth also caught the scent of a fox. Chive Spring wants to be chosen as the new deputy. Blue Paw is daydreaming. Wild Paw is gathering moss. I knew it! Okay, I'm gonna make Wild Paw Medicine Cat Apprentice. Gold Paw is gossiping. Little butthead. Nectar Paw is having a hard day. Oh. Nectar Paw's dad is, your, is her apprentice. Er, Jesus. Nectar Paw's dad is her mentor, so that doesn't surprise me. And Horse Paw hopes they will do battle training soon. Okay, now we have a bunch of apprentices to send out on a patrol, so I have to send everybody out with their mentor. I'm not sure what Kit doing. Thinking about future prophecies with Ferntail. And then let's send these two out. Reminiscing about the old days. Patrol finds a kitty pet who is interested in the clans. Patrol convinces the kitty pet to join. Okay, cool. We have another- we have another cat. Who are you? Maverick. Male. Vengeful. Let's give it a couple months and see what Maverick does. Skyseed is assigning cats to a hunting patrol. Webpelt thinks that they're going crazy. This is like the third time Webpelt has felt like they're going crazy. Blue Runner is feeling lazy. Clover Moth caught the scent of an enemy warrior earlier. Chive Spring caught the scent of a fox. Wants to spend time alone today. Wildpaw is struggling to remember all of the names of herbs. Goldpaw is gossiping. A freaking chorus Goldpaw is gossiping. What else would he be doing? Nectarpaw is sharing prey with Maverick. Horsepaw is visiting the medicine den. Maverick is fighting with Web Pelt. You come into this clan, they take you in, and you're fighting with the medicine cat. All right, so we just did something really drastic since there was a lot of drama going on. Uh, the leader and the deputy broke up. I'm worried for the clan now. And Skyseed got together with Blue Runner. Riverkit is worried about the cats in the dark forest. Oh no. All right, let's send out some patrols. Let's send out the two new lovers. The patrol comes across a rogue. The rogue leaves. Oh, horse paws got a scar now. Let's send out this one and the newbie. Patrol finds a fox and her cubs and drives them away. Okay, cool, cool. That probably gained a lot of experience, hopefully. Ooh, horse paw and gold paw duking it out in the apprentices done. Quiet Star is fighting with horse paw. Sky Seed is feeling happy. Quiet Star is, <laughs> Quiet Star is probably like heartbroken. Sky Seed is feeling happy. Web Pelt is looking forward to the half moon meeting. Blue Runner is sharing prey with a nectar paw. That's so cute. Chive Spring wants to go on patrol. Blue Paw is spending a considerable amount of time grooming. Wild Paw is feeling quite lazy. Gold Paw doesn't want to become a warrior yet. What did I say about Gold Paw? I said that Gold Paw was going to regret being so mature for such a young age. And here he is now not wanting to be a warrior. Called it. I said Gold Paw would regret it. And he's like, oh, time's going by too fast. I just want to be an apprentice. Goldpaw is vengeful. Nectarpaw is looking around camp. And Horsepaw is talking to themselves. Maverick's just relaxing. Okay, uh, Maverick. Maverick's gonna hook up with Chive Spring. Joel catches the scent of a large dog. The dog is driven away, but only after killing Maverick? No, Chive Spring and Maverick just got together. They just had a fling. They just got together. Oh my god, poor Chive Spring. Chive Spring, are you okay? Maverick is relaxing in camp. At least Maverick went to Star Clan. The leader's gonna take uh, all of his kids plus Horse Paw out and let's see what happens. Quiet Star notices the patrol isn't following the exact rules. Quiet Star's concerns are dismissed by the other cats. Uh, well, that, that, that's bound to happen if it's just a bunch of teenagers with a crotchety old adult. Web Pelt is gathering death berries. First web pelt was going insane and now he's gathering death berries and I'm kind of worried about it. Blue, Ner Blue Runner wants to go on a patrol. Clover Moth is curious about the other clans. Clover Moth, you better not be having a cross clan relationship. Chive Spring wants to spend time alone today. Blue Paw is acting angsty. Oh, he's an angsty boy. Wildpaw is helping organize the herb stores. I was thinking about the time they caught a huge rabbit. Nectarpaw can't wait to be a warrior. And horse is relaxing in camp. Dang, a horse got a huge scar. Let's send out horse and nectar kit. They're just casually having a fun day with each other. The hunting is good this green leaf. The patrol finds a nice spot to sun themselves. Unfortunately, the patrol doesn't get much accomplished beyond that. <laughs> I'm getting sibling energy from these two. It's kind of cute. 
Blue Patch has earned their warrior name. Okay, we got Blue Patch, Wild Splash, Gold Watcher, and Nectar Whisker. Oh, that's so cute. <gasps> no, the game. No. No, the game crashed. What? Oh no. Oh gosh, let's see what I lost. <gasps> it doesn't give me the option to continue. Why doesn't it give me the option to continue? 